Hey, what's up? <laughs> so we're back. Got some packages in the mail. Nothing major. So a couple of unboxings. So this one's from Amazon. And I believe I know what this is. Yep. So Amazon was running a special on their Lysol wipes. And I needed some more because I ran out for the new canister that I just bought. So I bought two of these. I want to say these were like $3 and some change. So I got a couple of those. And we're just going to refill them up. I'm still in love with it, y'all. Best purchase. <laughs> I'm so silly. Okay. So let's get this old one out. And the new one in. It ain't for the week. I miss David Arnold, y'all. I don't know if any of y'all followed him um, on any forms of social media. He was a stand-up comedian, and he had a lot of life left to live, unfortunately. The Lord called him home, but I do miss seeing his comedy and his face. Let's see. You know how stuff say like child proof? So I'm convinced there's a lot of stuff out there that's adult proof too. Cause why am I struggling with opening this? Okay. This don't make no sense. Okay, let's get her refilled. Okay, open it. And we're gonna thread that through. All right, sis. She's done. She's done. She's done. All right. This other stuff thrown away. Okay, we got another package. Hold your mood. Okay, so this package is from Target. Um, it is so dirty on the outside of the package. I don't even want to put it on my counter, y'all. So let me. So let me squeeze you in. And get some floor. Okay. We back in action. Oh, that was getting on my nerves for a second, y'all. Camera on to defocus and stuff. Okay. So. Let's get this open. Ugh, it is so dirty. I don't know what this package went through. Ugh, on the outside. Right. Here she is. In all of her glory. So this may look really familiar to you. So I already have this in like a camel caramel brown color. And at the time that I purchased it, they had black, but it was sold out. And that was like midst pandemic. And when I was on Target the other day, which I always am online, I saw that it was back in stock and now the camel color is sold out. So I decided to go ahead and grab this baby while supplies last. She is so cute. I love the extra long lumbar pillow. So the caramel color that's on my bed, I have it there to like add some contrast to the black, white, and gray in my bedroom. But I really wanna put this one <laughs> on my bed so bad. So I don't know. 
but you know i have them both so i can always go in between to switch it up but she's cute and stuffed good quality okay y'all so also from target online i almost forgot to show you so i purchased a new mattress protector so i don't know if y'all are like me where you buy something and you've had it for so long and you can't remember where you purchased it from so that's my current situation with my current mattress protector um i do change them out frequently i've gone through my walmart app i've gone through my target app my amazon app to just look at past orders like where did i purchase that one from i have no idea so um i purchased this one from target it looks very similar to the one that i have on my bed i want to say this is the same one <laughs> but i'm not sure but yes so it's quilted luxury by aller ease aller ease i will testify is a good brand i have the zippered pillowcases in those and something else I purchased bedding wise with this brand. So it's really, really good as you know, it pertains to being waterproof, temperature balancing, um, being real fitted, things like that. Antimicrobial, things like that. Honey, we want some defense against those dust bunnies and things. So it looks very similar guys to the one that I have on there now, but this is the king size and I'm gonna get her put on the bed. So I have some more packages in the mail that I would love to unbox with you guys. However, they are Christmas gifts and they are Christmas gifts for family and friends who watch my channel. So I don't wanna necessarily do that because they'll see what they have. They're already being so nosy. What'd you give me, what'd you give me? And I'm not telling them anything. So unfortunately for you guys, that will be a secret too. <laughs> Maybe they'll decide to share with you all on Christmas Day. I don't know. So let's see what else we can get into today. Come on. So when I mentioned, let's see what else we could get into today, I decided impulsively to go see Black Panther. I am surprised that it is still in theaters. And at the same time, I'm not because of the raving reviews and the uh, monumental undertone. I see today is the last day, so we looked up so let's go catch the evening show i can't take you in there with me girl because i can't be copyrighted now see y'all in a bit hey so we were back home and relaxed and the Black Panther was so good. I love the way that they incorporated Chad in like the rolling credits. Also in the very beginning um, where the Marvel theme comes up, how they have him intertwined into the whole logo. And then at the end, it was just like, oh my gosh, you know, I'm a G, but I kept it together. But I love the way they tributed him. In the beginning throughout and the end of the film so i absolutely loved it there are a lot of twists and turns that i did not expect but i won't ruin it for anyone who has not watched it yet um i'm finally just now getting to see it and y'all today was the first day in three and a half years that i physically sat in a movie theater i used to go all the time sometimes watching two movies a day because that's my thing like tv series and movies and then when covid hit you know, I hadn't gone in quite some time. I didn't expect a lot of people to be in there this evening, but it was quite a bit, but I still enjoyed it. I made a quick stop by Academy. I didn't even attempt to record y'all from the parking lot to going inside of the store. It was just so congested. They were running a bunch of sales, but I'm like, what is everybody buying? Cause some of the sales, I didn't feel were sale worthy. So I'm like, what are people buying? And then the line, was from the front of the store where the registers are all the way to like the gun department. I'm like, oh my God. So I just picked up a few things. So I picked up some more workout socks. These are Adidas. I like the long dry fit by Nike, the crew socks that come up the calf for me because I'm so short, my foot is so little. But um, I also like these. So they come, I would say mid calf on me. Uh, definitely above the ankle 
and I definitely like the aesthetic of these very comfortable they're not as thick as the Nike crew socks dry fit but I kind of like that because sometimes you know you don't want that but these are compression socks um, <clears throat> I got them in the men's but the shoe size is from 6 to 12 and I am a 7 in men's I actually prefer men's socks they're just much more comfortable to me for some reason so those were $11.99 and then they had their Nike apparel as far as the shirts the logo crew shirts they had them on sale for $19.99 and so I got two of those so this is really really cute it's the Nike logo something simple I really went for this color because as you know I've got those Oswego Adidas foam shoes that are this color shade of green so yeah and I got these shirts in men again I feel like men clothing when it comes to crew tees and apparel like this it's just much more comfortable I love the fit too as far as the chest area my well endowed ladies I'm sure y'all can understand so and yes I got the same shirt in a different color mind your business <laughs> and I liked the colors in this one too because I have some shoes that will match well and I got both of these in a 2x kind of leave me some room I like to have room so that's that let's see what we got from Walmart so this is just part of the order again i'm still ordering gifts so some of the items in that pickup order that we did yesterday had gifts in it so um as far as household needs this is what we have so we have the bounty paper towels we have some hygiene products the gillette satin care this is a really good shaving gel for those who can relate it's for the very ultra sensitive so this is a gem. I've been using it for years. Um, and then we got some Lysol laundry sanitizer. I love mixing this in with my wipes um, when I'm doing my clothes. They've recently formatted the formula to include COVID-19 virus. This is really, really good. I would even say that this is essential to use in everyday laundry. And of course, the infamous downy beads. I love to get the light scent, even though it's light. The scent in these are still potent. It's not heavy, but it is potent. But I absolutely love these. Not only do I love them because of the scent, but they are also aesthetic. That's our little haul from Walmart. So let's go ahead and get this liquid and scent booster beads put in the jars. I don't know about y'all who have like extreme laundry organization syndrome. Yes, I made that up but it just does something to me to just refill those items in my laundry room as you'll see here in the next clip i just absolutely love it i'm weird it's okay <laughs>
So that wraps up for today. As always, if you made it this far, I appreciate you and thank you so much for watching. If you like all things home decor and lifestyle, don't forget to hit that subscribe button before you leave if you haven't already. And if you have, turn on those notification bells so that you don't miss any future content. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.